born left-handed and then I was later switched to being a right-handed person um, so I might still have a little bit of function to use my left hand right um, or it may still come out looking good so yeah that's the fun fact I was once a lefty so my dominant hand is my right hand so I'm gonna be using my left hand to apply the makeup today so today's makeup challenge is to apply the makeup with my opposite hand all right so i'm going to start to apply the makeup with my left hand because it is the less dominant hand da, 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 da. so i'm gonna as i said before i was once a lefty when i was born but my mother changed me to a righty so here it is it doesn't feel so uncomfortable I'm gonna use it and just follow through I'm actually very confident about this so as I said before I was once a lefty so and sometimes when I write with my left hand it looks really good Sometimes, but why does it look so funny when I'm holding it? Alright, that's that bro. Now the next one, you want to turn it. <laughs> hey, you want to turn it like so. There we go nice so I followed the lining very it was just very thorough very quick and easy very quick and easy not much of a hassle I do not like to feel anxious so whenever that feeling comes over me and if that feeling comes over me take a deep breath and I feel better speak some positivity over myself so right now I'm really not feeling like I'm failing all right so I am going to use a clean brush it might not look clean but it's clean it's just stained by the makeup that I've used and I'm gonna use my left hand again this is my right hand by the way Use my left hand and just dab it. I think I'm doing a really good job. Very confident in myself. Very, very confident. Because I'm coming like, I'm not even having any problems. It's just the way I hold the brush that it looks like I'm holding it wrong. Why did this happen? So, chill. So I'm dabbing, dab, 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 dab. And today I'm gonna go for a very basic makeup. Not going in very harsh. Not going in with any big thing. 
All right, so I'm gonna cover the entire lid with the fawn. There we go, like so. Like so. Very confident, as I said. Very confident. No small details, no eyeliner. I'm not using no eyeliner. You must be mad. gonna go in with my beauty blender it sounds like a smart thing to do and just go in like this there we go nice nice and clean fresh and clean fresh and clean yeah all right that's perfect obviously I'm not a lefty so it could have been better all right now I'm going to use Chestnut in the same pro, what's it called? LA Girl Pro Concealer for the top part of my brows. Left, left hand, left hand. This is about my, this is, yeah, it's nice. Ooh. I'm gonna make sure. There we go. Nice. Nice. I might have gone in too much. I'm gonna I'm gonna delete this. <laughs> Go back over the arch just double looks all right so I'm gonna go back in it looks all right but to me it never look all right I'm gonna go back in with the same thing I just read it fresh and clean fresh and clean all right in the arch in I love my brows I got my brows done because I had a huge insecurity about my original natural brows. Because I had a, I had less hair. And it just never gave me the look that I wanted. A refined look. Look at that stupid look at that. Let me just stop talk. What? Let me start talking. No man, it's hard. It's rough. I should have just left it. I should have just left it, man. Yeah. Where's the spoolie when I need the spoolie? Alright, I'm gonna go back in. I'm not gonna talk. But that little hair, my little hair. I'm going to go back in. Nice. I'm going to leave it like that. I love to trouble my brows right now. It's not giving me the look that I wanted to look. I'm going to go over it. It's gonna be harder, but I hope it's not. There's always gonna be a brow that I prefer or that anyone prefers over the other, and it's gonna be this one all day, every day. All right, so that looked good. I'm not even gonna go in and touch it. Obviously, I wanna improve on it, but. But, yeah, I'm not going to trouble it. Dab, 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 dab. This beauty blender came in very handy. I think I went in too much. This beauty 
Beauty Blender came in very handy. Alright. I can't be touch I can't be using my right hand at all. So here we have covering the eye itself. The lid going over the lid. There we go. Nice and easy. Nice and easy does it every time. Do perfect now I am gonna go in with um, obviously making my shadow I am not doing anything difficult all right I'm actually doing a really good job I'm actually doing a really good job at this doing a very good job at this all right there we go now I'm gonna go in all right I'll be using this palette is called the warrior by Juvia's the warrior by Juvia's and I'm gonna go in with the darkest color which is Mino M-I-N-O right and I'm gonna go into the outside. Uh, where's the brush? I'm gonna go into using my left hand again. You, I'm gonna go into the 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 way you call this part now. The outside crease, the outside something, and I'm gonna dab 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 because you want it. To look super blended in a way, yeah, baby. Yeah, nice. I'm gonna go in again. <laughs> this is very pigmented. This eyeshadow palette super pigmented i've heard of, i've always heard great things about juvia's always always and forever always and forever and so we're gonna make sure that this is nicely blended we'll have to pack it up a little bit more all right there we go I'm gonna go back in with this one. Perfect. Now, with the same little brush that I had before, it's gonna help to blend it out. Especially right here. Just a tiny bit. Just a tiny bit. Just a tiny bit. Just a tiny bit. I mean, I love it. I love what I'm doing. This is amazing. I love how I'm doing it. It's awesome. I didn't think, I thought it was going to be a little bit harder to deal with, but it's not. Alright. Next thing I'm going to use is um. I'm gonna go in with um with Ahosi Ahosi which is a matte nude and just bring it right here so nice and simple make sure it's fully blended This is just on my 
trees and it's just nice. All right, there we go. That's so nice. And then I'm gonna go back in with the same that. Nothing too crazy. I'm patty, so we're getting rid of all the harsh lines. Here. There we go. Perfect. So I might just put a little bit of the eyeliner to the end of my eyes, like here. What is that, man? What did I just do? Alright, I'm gonna go back over here. And I'm gonna. Oh, that one looks nice. That one looks nice. But the other one, I struggle, man. Okay, that looks nice. That looks nice. I'm gonna go in and clean this up with something afterwards. Although my eyelashes are just. Do I even have any eyelashes? Okay. Alright. So I have some wipes which I have been using, and what I'm gonna do is go in with my left hand and just wipe it up a little bit like so oh that looked nice that looks really nice oh simmy 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 that looked nice i can't lie i can't lie i cannot lie to myself and then i'm gonna cut this one too and make it there we go it should look nicey it should look nice she look nice. I wish I could. I'm gonna fix it. Where did it go? Is this a sign that I shouldn't touch it? They always say, don't fix what's not broken. Don't go in there and blurring it and ruin it, my friend. Oh. Oh. How I love you. Oh, how I love Jesus. All right, I'm gonna fix it now again. Oh, how I love Jesus. That looks nice, right? Give me a thumbs up. If you agree that I'm doing a really good job for a righty, I'm a right-handed person and I think I'm doing a really good job, especially with the fact that I've been using my right hand since I was born. So I think I'm doing a really good job going back in to patting the cream looking nude a little bit and then oops I damn I ruined I ruined something but I'm gonna fix it right, I'm gonna go in with the one that looks like it have no on it and just blend it out 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 I have like oh my god I did really good and I messed it up it's been really good let me get back in I wanna fix it I want to fix it so right here it should be dark there shouldn't be any form of lightness over here okay nice nice then go in with the one that I have Where? This one that doesn't have anything on there. And tap out, blend it all, removing the harsh lines. And then, go into this one. There we go. Kind of removing the harsh line that I'm seeing here. Perfect. Alright, guys, that's done. Now, one of the hardest parts is putting on my lashes. I need both of my hands 
for my lashes. I don't think I'll be able to do it. So meanwhile, I wait for the lash to dry. I'm going to go in with this foundation from Juvia's Place. And it's a matte. I need to stop using matte foundations because I already have very, 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 very dry skin. I don't even know the foundation. I am magic. Is that the one? Full coverage. Is this the one? I am magic. All right, so. All right, so here we have la foundation. I'm going to apply it to the skin. Nice. I actually have a primer, but I forgot that. Oops. The trouble is going to be me putting on my lashes in. Perfect. Hey. My eyelash, my eyelash application was the one that I was most worried about because I have very bushy lashes, very confused, very all over the place kind of lash. And whenever I apply my lashes, I have to use both hands. This is the first time I'm actually using one hand. Oh my gosh, it's amazing. Awesome, look at that. All right. So now that I have applied my lashes with my left hand, very proud of myself. Nice. That's nice. Next one. That's not really bright. Alright, there we go. Underneath my eye. Alright. On my chin. And then here. And then here. There we go. Nice. I'm going to go into the beauty blender to blend everything in. Nicely. Right. Guys, and again, I'm still using my left hand, so this is very nice to know that I can use my left hand without freaking out so much. I thought I was going to do really bad.
to set it a little. Set it. Some of this brush. Set it a little. Anything you can do, I can do better. And then this side. Just setting the highlight. because I don't want it to stay too long on my skin. I don't want it. Now that I have set my face, I'm going to use the Fit Me in 40. And I'm going to use the same left hand. I'm going to use the same one to just help me contour. Right here, so. Right here, so help me contour. Right here, so it's very red. And then some at my jawbone right here. Blend out some craziness contour I think I put it in the wrong section yeah I think right. just dabbing it down to move in with a waterproof eye lip line pencil and just shape for my lip Alright guys, so that is it for my challenge which is to use or to apply my makeup with my less dominant hand. Um, the concealer application was quite easy. The only problem was this little brow hair. Uh, what else? The eyeshadow, I had to go over it a few more times. And my lashes, I thought it was going to be even more difficult because I'm really not good at applying my own lashes. I have to use like both hands and I have to whatever but this taught me how to do it the right way um, with one hand and it was my left hand so I, if I could do it with my left hand I could more than do it with my right hand and yeah thank you so much for watching and um, stay tuned to the next video it's gonna be very interesting if you've gone this far in the video please give me a thumbs up if you want me to do another challenge 
subscribe i will do more i'll be more than happy to um i love seeing the interaction so thank you comment below what you'd like to see next what challenge you'd like to see next um what videos you'd like to see next and in the next video next week sunday you will be seeing a very interesting video um and it reminds me a lot about the donna lee um investigation that is currently happening in jamaica um i hope she's okay but with this the prediction i predict it's not a good thing and i really hope that she's okay but from what what um i've watched throughout the years with investigation series and all those things and it's really it just looks like it's gonna be something that's not good and it really just reminds me of a case that i had um um that i had researched last year and i was supposed to put it out but because of this case i feel so led to put it out because i feel like it's it's so similar it's really so similar um uh, my prayers goes out to finding Donna Lee and um, yeah but stay tuned to next week's video and I hope you guys have a great day thank you so much for subscribing thank you so much for liking please like this video I did a really good job right right I think I did a really good job I did a really good job I did a really good job I love it my left hand my left hand I don't use my left hand at all it looks really good it looks really good yeah Con the blending and everything just came out really good my foundation came out really good um, my brow concealing came out very good and everything my lashes like if you're my friend and you've been my friend for years or from ever since I've started my makeup journey you'll know that Applying my lashes is one of the hardest things because I have really bushy, confused lashes and it really is hard to put on my lashes myself. So when I do this with my one hand, left hand, it's really, it really does make me feel really good. So yeah, if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up right now, right now, right now, right now, like the video and subscribe and share it, right? And tell me which other challenge you want me to do in the future. Goodbye.